I'm actually putting out some more cameras. We had taken down most of our cameras to get fresh batteries and clean off the SD cards. I'm gonna put some more back up. <clears throat> I, I personally enjoy watching the deer start to develop, start to grow the antlers, but also, you know, first year of ownership, you know, see, make sure we don't have trespassers and issues like that. So, uh, mushroom season's, you know, coming upon us and that's typically when you have a lot of issues. So, we're gonna put some cameras up. I'm at a spot right now that was probably one of the most productive camera spots on the farm. Uh, I had a, a camera on this tree a couple yards to my right uh, overlooking the scrape and I'd say we probably got every buck on the farm on this particular scrape. The river's really close. This is the, the peninsula on our farm. Uh, they actually cross the river right here. Uh, but it's really cool. So th this, what we are running in, in a lot of these spots on the peninsula is this cutty, cutty back with the cutty link system. And the nice thing about that is it actually sends the pictures to a home camera that we had on the field edge. So it's easy to check that. These cameras daisy link to each other, send the pictures all the way to the home camera. And that way we don't have to go clear back in this peninsula, run the deer off everywhere. Um, this is just a nice system to you know, keep the pressure down and uh, just allows you to put cameras in more strategic spots, deep into the bedding areas, deep into just hard to access spots. So it worked really well for us last year. And like I said, this, this spot especially produced really well. I'm actually gonna put this camera right back in the same spot. Obviously the, the scrape isn't active right now, but that trail is still beat down. So I imagine they're using it like I said, this is one of the more productive spots on the farm last fall, and I think what makes it so productive is it, it follows the bend of this river. So there's a lot of edge kind of coming together. You got the edge. This is really close to actually where uh, Mike killed Gronk uh, on November 10th. It was, I mean, less than 75 yards from here. So they, they just traveled this river. It's a nice little pinch. Uh, so I think that's what makes this uh, such, a, such a good spot for so many good bucks traveling through here. The one nice thing, uh, these cameras that we're putting way back in here, you know, with the Cuddy Link system, we don't have to come check these cameras. They're sending the pictures out here to our home camera. Um, so it's nice having this extra battery pack so you don't have to come back in and change the batteries very often. And one other, one other real benefit to this system for us is we own some ground on the other side of the river right here. And uh, we have a couple cameras over there, and obviously we don't want to come boat across every single every single time we're here to check those cameras. This Cuddy Link system sends them across the river where we can actually access the card and the pictures. So that's a huge benefit uh, for us and our actual setup here on this piece of ground.